Hey everybody, we're here with uh, Tony from Lifestyle Garage. Tony is the owner here, and uh, we're getting. This is where we're getting our alignment done, our four uh, four wheel drive alignment. This is a. They do a lot of Jeep stuff. I mean, uh, you look around and you just see a bunch of Jeep stuff. So uh, they they definitely are no stranger to the Jeep. So Tony, tell me a little bit about Lifestyle Garage and what what all y'all do here. Lifestyle Garage has been in business for a little more than a year. Uh, we started October of last year and outgrew our facility pretty quickly. Um, we're now in our lakeside location at 9668 Winter Gardens. Um, uh, and we, we love Jeeps, we love fleet work, and we love regular car stuff. Uh, I personally have been working on uh, Jeeps and lifted trucks since 1993, so I am not a stranger. I don't know everything. Um, uh, but our first priority is customer service transparency, honesty, and integrity. Uh, we want to offer quality products at a competitive price, and we'd love to see you all. That's awesome. Tony, uh, what you said hits the nail on the head for me. Uh, quality customer service, quality work, and a competitive price. That's that's all you can ask for in this that's world it. today. That's it. Yeah. And uh, we appreciate everything you're doing. Uh, I'll tell you, your guys are top notch, and I really do appreciate all the work y'all are doing. And uh, you'll have you'll have my business for a long time to come. Thank you very much. We appreciate you, and look forward to seeing you many times, and your friends and family, and uh, all of those. So everybody, I want y'all to uh, take note. This is Lifestyle Garage, like I said. That come is on our out. Temporary signage. <laughs> there we go. They just got moved in, and they got six bays here. Eight. Eight bays. Oh, my bad. Eight, eight bays. bays. Eight bays. Eight so they've got eight bays here. Uh, they can take care of all your off-road, four-wheel drive needs, fleet needs, any any car that you need worked on, anything. So oil just change, uh, oil change, oil Check changes, engine, oil change, tires, brakes alignments, oil change, AC, lift kits, lowering gears and lockers. I personally have been doing gears since 1993, so I'm no stranger to ring and pinions, lockers, things like that. Uh, awesome. And we're always open to learn what we can from our customers because uh, there's a wealth of knowledge out there and people know things that I don't, so. Absolutely, and I, just so y'all know, I am not a professional at anything but uh, uh, talking crap. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Uh, I, I, uh, I, when it comes to stuff like this, I definitely want to take it to the pros and, and uh, this, is where, this is the place that I chose. So, uh, guys. Okay guys, so right here, they are doing the initial measurements to figure out what all needs to be done for the Iron Eagle. And uh, they are, I guess this kind of starts it off and kind of gives them a rough spot to start from and then they'll put the lasers on there and get it all dialed in perfect. But this right here helps them to get the axle centered and everything like that. I'm sorry, I put the hand on that one. <laughs> I really put the juice on that one, I'm sorry. That's all right. <laughs> you gotta keep this one tight. Yeah, because I, I actually uh, did that because of the, uh, on all the forums they were saying how that track bar gets screwed up because people don't tighten that nut, jam nut down hard enough. That's right. And it, it, it works against them threads and screws it all up. They do. I put Loctite on it, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm a Loctite boy right now. But you will be glad to know I did not Loctite any control on. I did that for you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, I think your wife called better. Do you need me to push on something? Uh, well. I don't mind helping. I gotta find all my toys. All right. My boys be getting them all. Okay. Okay guys, so uh, we were about an inch and a half off uh, coming to the passenger. We were inch and a half farther over towards passenger. And um, he uh, he's adjusted the track bar and uh, I believe he's probably got that in the right spot now. And all he did, all he used was like a pry bar to, uh, to shift it just a little bit. Didn't take a lot. Um, I'm assuming it's because he's on those and it slides pretty easy. Uh, it would probably take a little bit more, but he also said that if he needed to, he had the porter power right there. So he is, uh, when you got the pros doing it, they, they can get it done. 
All right. It takes uh, takes us a lot more effort because we don't have all the right tools when we're working on it in our garages or whatnot. But they they can just go right through it. That's why we can. So he's using this uh, porta power to, uh, I don't know if y'all can see that. And he's got it wedged up in there and it's pushing against the axle and kind of from the body to the axle. And it is, whenever he jacks it right there like that, it is actually pushing the axle over to get it lined up and then he just uh, puts the track bar in place. So he has loaded up the suspension and he is setting the angles right now. See how he's got that done, guys? He's got jacks up under uh, the shock towers on both sides and he's lifted it up and loaded it so that he can pull the uh, control arms and adjust it. So that's the way to do it right, right there. You, got, you can move it and do whatever you have to do by moving that little bad boy right down there. So this is the way you do it when you got the right kind of tools. And what is what does this do? So this is a four wheel laser alignment. This will go in and give us our rear uh, side to side numbers uh, as well as our front toe uh, camber and caster. All right. Thank you very much. You're there you have it, guys. All right, so I'm here with uh, Devin, not Kevin, but Devin. <laughs> and uh, with Lifestyle Garage, he just got through uh, wrapping up Iron Eagle and getting it uh, dialed in. So why don't you tell us a little bit about what you had to do to it? So we brought her in today and we did a four wheel laser alignment on the Jeep. We noticed a few things while we were in there, a couple of loose jam nuts. We also noticed that the front track was off. We went ahead and reset the front side square, got that dialed in, adjusted the caster, adjusted the upper arms uh, to match. So made the uh, angles correct, got the vehicle driving straight, got it driving well, uh, did a final adjustment on the gearbox to polish everything off. Uh, and the American Eagle now drives down the road, nice, straight and tight. Thank you, thank, thank you. you. All right, well, hey guys, like I said, I, I can't speak enough about this. They are great guys out here. They did a great job. I drove her down the road. She and she's doing great, and uh, we are uh, super pleased. I am super pleased. I think Ashley's going to be super pleased because she'll get to be able to drive the Jeep again. It was throwing her all over the road, and she couldn't handle it. So uh, there again, I just I appreciate you, Devin. I appreciate all your hard work. I appreciate work. you coming in and bringing in your rig, sir. Thank uh, you. Thank you.